few people have left such a profound impact on Oakland Unified School District as our first black superintendent, Dr. Marcus Foster. He was superintendent for just three years before his life was tragically cut far too short in 1973. And here we are half a century later to honor all that he has done here in OUSD. Hello, I'm Superintendent Kyla Johnson Trammell, and I am honored to hold the same position that Dr. Foster held. And it is truly humbling to receive a legacy award from the Marcus Foster Education Institute. Dr. Marcus Foster is the originator, actually, of the vision for our district. Uh, he spearheaded the vision of being a full service community district decades ago uh, that we are now having the pleasure to realize uh, in 2023. I mean, he's also just been such an inspirational mentor to generations of OUSD educators. I mean, it is truly an honor to continue the work um, and to help to flourish some of the seeds that he helped to plant within this district decades ago. The best thing about being recognized by the Marcus Foster Education Institute is that I am just one part of a group of amazing educators from OUSD being so honored. Our 17 members who are also being honored are Fremont High graduate and now principal, Nidia Baez. Latino Student Achievement Targeted Specialist, Eve Delfin, Culinary Arts Teacher, Chef David Eisenberg from Ralph Bunch Academy, Program Manager Tiago Robinson from African American Male Achievement, Longtime Administrator and Principal, Dr. Denise Sadler, Oakland High Wellness Center Director, Rainey F., and Longtime McClyman's High School Teacher, Dr. Lupalette Taylor. I speak for all of us when I say thank you to the Marcus Foster Education Institute for paying homage to OUSD staff members, both past and present. We are all so excited by this honor and to be on the same list of 100 honorees as people like Cesar Chavez, Maya Angelou, Fred Korematsu, and Stefan and Aisha Curry. We look forward to celebrating what would have been Dr. Foster's 100th birthday, March 31st, which just happens to also be Cesar Chavez's birthday. <laughs>